The Dublin VA Medical Center rolled out a new way for veterans to get to their medical appointments. The program is called VA Uber Health Connect. It's a pilot program that's currently available in Macon, Brunswick and Albany, but they hope to expand it to more areas soon. Soline Arif explains why the VA said it was time to call in reinforcements. Many Central Georgia veterans come to this VA in Dublin to receive medical care. But it's not always so easy. Um, and normally if someone can't reach their appointment, it's, it's due to um, no transportation. The VA helps pick up and drop off veterans who need rides. But with only eight employees for over 40,000 veterans in the area, it's just not enough. Because there's been certain situations to where we've been scheduled up for you know, days within advance and a veteran needs a ride, but we don't have any drivers to pick them up. That's why they launched the VHA Uber Health Connect. So here's how it works. Veterans can call the VA if they need a ride. The VA will book their trip and send the details right to their phone, and they can check on the progress of it in the Uber app. According to the American Hospital Association, 3.6 million people in the U.S. don't get medical care because of transportation problems. It's a nationwide problem, but it's more common in rural areas. I'm going to emphasize that they can use the Uber ride because you know, it'd be beneficial to him. Mouton served two tours in the Army and is now a volunteer at the VA. He said he knows many veterans who struggle with finding rides here. No, no transportation. We got Candace, but that's expensive. The new program could make it affordable and easy to catch a ride. But to make that happen, the VA needs some help from the public. Uh, currently, uh, one of the barriers for the Dublin area specifically is there are no Uber drivers. So we're hoping with you know, promotion of this initiative that more Uber drivers have come to this area, which will expand our services. Reporting in Dublin, I'm Celine Arif, 13 WMAZ News. The VA wants Uber drivers to consider coming to their area so they can help those who need rides. The program will supplement their eight employees who currently drive veterans to and from appointments. However, the number of veterans are increasing each year, so they hope this program can help everyone out. They also encourage all local veterans to follow them on Facebook for updates on this program and others.